To detect antibodies in the blood, there are several testing techniques available. One is by so-called electrochemiluminescence. In the lab, proteins that match those of SARS-CoV-2 are produced in large quantities using molecular biological methods. They are divided into two parts. One portion is labelled with a chemical element, ruthenium. It plays the role of a biological flashlight. The remaining part of the produced proteins are labelled with biotin, which will act like an immunological anchor. These two portions are then incubated with the patient's blood sample. If there are antibodies against SARS-CoV-2, the two differently labelled proteins act similarly to tweezers, targeting the antibody, so to speak. The result is a double antigen sandwich complex. In the next reaction step, tiny paramagnetic beads bind to the biotin anchor. These complexes enter the measuring cell of the analyzer. A current is applied to an electrode, turning it magnetic. All beads remain on the surface of the electrode. A special solution is added, oxidizing the ruthenium. This turns the biological flashlight on, indicating that there are antibodies in the sample.